DIY for and it's another video for my cheap thrill series uh, taking dollar store products and making it into a cheap DIY for you. All of the previous videos will be linked down below but for today's video that basket just a roll of paper some scissors hot glue gun and a little bit of paint. So first you're just going to start by cutting a bunch of long strips of paper. I made mine probably like about an inch to two inches wide. Once you have a ton of those, we're going to go back and we're going to fold these into themselves. This is mostly just to kind of strengthen it up and uh, to make them a little bit thinner as well. So I folded them both in on both sides and then I just hot glued that together because you can get a glue gun at the dollar store and because it dries really quickly and you can use it almost immediately. So then you're going going to um, start to make a pinwheel for your base. So I glued all of these pieces together. Keep in mind you'll want to keep the rough edges on the inside so that no one can see this. I kind of forgot about that with some of mine. Once you have your pinwheel you can go back and get, uh, glue down another thin strip and then we're going to begin weaving the base of this basket. So because it is a circle you have to fold this uh, strand of paper uh, ever so often so that you can continue in that circle as you can see what I'm doing here for Holding over those edges to create that circle but it's really easy once you get going it takes a little while but you're weaving under over under over just like a basket so once I had my base done I did decide to make the side strips a lot thicker because I wanted this process to speed up so I went back and made about inch wide strips uh, and did a bunch of those for the side of the basket even though I like the way that the base looks a lot more than the sides but whatever the this was a lot speedier and basically you just go around and you continue your weaving process in and out or under and over hot gluing all along the way and then once you get done this is pretty much what your basket looks like uh, I took those extra ends that were still sticking up folded them over slightly and then just hot glued them into place now this last step is optional uh, I wanted to paint it white to go along with my decor so this is just uh, cheap acrylic paint from the dollar store uh, and a sponge brush and I kind of gave it a rough looking paint job to mimic like wicker. So that's this month's Cheap Thrills video. It is the most time consuming project that I've done in that series, but it's also the cheapest one. It's just made out of paper, so be careful with it. It's more meant of a decor piece, not as a functioning paper basket. And that's exactly how I'm using it, as a decor piece to cover up that ugly black pot that plants just come in. And because wicker baskets seem to be very on trend all over Pinterest and the stores right now, I thought that I would DIY my own version and that literally cost me less than $3 to make. So if you try it for yourself, send me some photos. You can follow me on Instagram and on Twitter, at Janelle Steeper. Just tag me in any of those posts. Uh, if you make the DIY, I wanna see it. And don't forget to subscribe. I will be back next Wednesday with a new video. Cheers. Breaking my nails. Ugh. Video. Video. Why do I always do that? Ah!